Happy day vlogmas day 16. Somebody put our <laughs> little blind bag ornaments that we got on the tree. So <laughs> it's sort of decorated. Um, the elf forgot to move last night. I think he's just very comfortable there on the top of the tree. Um, let's go ahead. Let's go ahead and look at our tea for today because I might have some tea in a little bit. Looks like I'm not going to like it. <laughs> this is called Elf Help. Let's see. Let's see what that Elf Help is. Elf Help is a green tea. See, I told you I was not going to like it. Green tea, black currants, orange peel, papaya, apple, cranberries, coconut, and natural flavoring. So, um, let's see what tea I'm probably going to have today. Actually, I think I'm going to try the Fireside Mocha. Oh, sorry about that. Um, that sounds delicious. Pretty chill day. I need to drink water. I'm very dehydrated. Um, I need to straighten up down here because it's a mess. Granted, none of it is my mess, but that's another story. Um, so this morning, I need to blog. If you saw my um, video from last, I think it was last Friday, um, I vlogged. I blogged and only got one <laughs> blog written. So I'm hoping to get at least two done today. And then um, go through my Friday work box right there. And then I have a doctor's appointment this afternoon. Then pick up the kids from school. Um, this evening at 545, I have a consultation with a potential client. And then I'm going to build the bud vases that um, we got the flowers for at Trader Joe's yesterday. Um, and these go in that also. So I will show you, whew, not a florist, but I've done this a few times for smaller parties and um, things, my own parties. So I will show you kind of my method for doing that. Um, and I'm going to do an example tablescape to kind of see what um, it will look like at the party on Sunday and kind of how I want it to lay it out. Um, oh anyway. my gosh, you guys, look what my best friend just sent me. Does she know me or does she know me? Oh my gosh. Thank you, Kaylin. And she knows we do a hot chocolate bar. Those are perfect. I also got this in the mail today. For my party that we're having on Sunday. So exciting. I ordered the design from Etsy, customized it myself, and then had it printed from Office Max, I believe it was, Office Depot, something like that. I'll put the link for the design below. But isn't that so cute? And it came wrapped so well. I had it just shipped to the house. Love it. Well, I did it. <clears throat> I blogged two weddings. This beautiful one and this gorgeous one. Um, I did not do my work box though. <coughs> Excuse me. I um, decided to finish that second blog because um, I don't have anything really planned for this evening. So I can go through my work box then. Um, it's about 12.30 now. I just ate a small little lunch. And I'm going to go through my email. 
and finish up any client things that I would like to do this week. Um, and then go to my doctor's appointment. Okay, we are going to make bud faces now. <laughs> um, this is actually the next day from when you're watching this, but I um, promised you in yesterday's video when I was filming that I would show you this. So I want to get it done so it's in, in the video that you're watching. So, disclaimer, like I said before, I'm not a florist. Um, this is just what I've done the last few times I've made kind of bud vases for an event, whether it be my own or a client. I do not do floral for weddings. I've only really done floral for one event. And they bought the flowers, they bought the vases. I just helped them put them together for a birthday party. So I'm gonna set you here, because I don't have my tripod right now. And hope that everything is in the shot. So I have these bud vases from Amazon. And they came in a six pack. So that's what we're going to make. We are going to go ahead and fill them. I'm going to fill them up all the way to the neck of the bottle because they have to sit till tomorrow. And it's always kind of dry in my house, so I don't want to have to worry about adding more water tomorrow. Okay, so what I One, two, three, four, five, six, eight, ten, twelve. So there's twelve roses. So we know that each one can have two roses. Then there's one, two, three, four, six stems here. So we can use one of each of these in the bud vases. So next what I do is look at the height of the, the vase and think how far I want the flowers to stick out. So these, I kind of want these close to the rim, um, but these are multiple on one stem. So I may cut it down, you know, pretty far and then have multiple stems per face. So I'm going to do one first so I can make sure it looks how I want it and then do the rest. So if I cut here and I'm going to get rid of a lot of these leaves, you at least want to get rid of leaves that are going to be in water. And then see how when I cut it, it actually makes 
multiple stems. Then when you stick it in, you want to kind of crisscross. so that it fills in more and it kind of holds a shape. I kind of like the whimsy of the different levels also. So I'll do the same with the roses. I'm going to uh, guesstimate kind of how tall I want it. Um, this one I want a little bit taller and then I'll cut the other one to sit a little bit shorter. And again, I'm going to cut off the leaves here. And let's try that. I think that's still a little too tall, but let's get the other one and see. stems from Amazon. Kind of shake them a little bit. I'm actually going to take these bows off. Oh, I maybe I shouldn't take the bows off because they're, that's how it's attached. And stick those in, and I have 12 of those, so I can put one on either side. Cute. Let me show you a close up. Very cute and festive. Actually, I had 10 of those, so four of them have two and two of them have one. Super cute. Then, here is how I will lay the tables out. All right, so this is what I've got. I'm actually reconsidering using the greenery because it shed a lot. And I really don't want to make a mess at the restaurant. So, and I'll also have some votives throughout. We'll see. I'll show you tomorrow. I'll show. I'll have time to show you before everybody arrives. And 
I just want to show you I transport them in the same box that they were shipped in even with flowers and everything. I'm running a couple errands. Look at the white stuff on O's car. <laughs> It's almost winter time y'all it is winter time it's almost time for snow we actually look it's snowing it's so pretty how slow it's falling dinner time dinner time 